Hey guys, it's Cameron. Welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys my pamper routine. Finals are coming up and I really want to just de-stress and relax. So that's what I'm going to be doing in this video. Before I start anything, I'm just going to switch out all of my old towels for new ones. I had been using them for a few days and it's really important to switch out your towels every few days. Here I am just taking out my earrings. I'm going to be cleaning them soon. For now, I'm just going to be cleaning off my ear with some rubbing alcohol. And now I'm going to be washing my face with this vitamin C facial wash. This is kind of like an exfoliator. So I wanted to use an exfoliator now with my exfoliating pad just to get rid of all of the dead skin and extra dirt and build up on my skin and I like to always exfoliate my face right before I'm gonna be shaving my face and then I'm going to be just taking off the rest of my eye makeup with my bioderma micellar water so now I'm gonna be taking this face razor and I'm shaving my face this is called dermaplaning and it's actually really safe the hair doesn't grow back thick it actually just leaves your skin really smooth it makes for better application of skincare products and makeup it really allows it all to like seep into your skin and it also gets rid of all the dead skin and all the peach fuzz on your face Now I'm going back to my earrings. I'm just going to be filling the little cap of the rubbing alcohol and I'm going to be putting the earrings in there to let them soak. And then I'm just going to be using this Kleenite retainer cleaning solution. I'm putting a cap full in a cup with some water and I'm just going to put my retainer in there and let it soak. If you have a retainer, it's really important to clean it every once in a while. And now it's time to get in the shower. I'm just taking my hair out of this disgusting bun. At this point in the video, I just look a mess. And you guys are going to see how much of a mess I look throughout the video. So be prepared. And I heard about this technique from another YouTuber where you should put essential oils in your shower just to like give it a more relaxing vibe. So I used lavender essential oil. And now I'm washing my hair. I'm using head and shoulders. Um, I get very dry scalp and head and shoulders tends to regulate that really helps my hair. I have such dry hair and it gives it a lot of moisture. And now I'm going to be putting a hair mask in. I'm using this Garnier Fructis hair mask and I'm just going to be putting it all throughout my hair. This is a very light hair mask. It's nothing crazy. It's actually supposed to be used as a minute mask, but I like to use it for a longer period of time. So I'm just rubbing it through my hair and then clipping my hair up and putting it in a shower cap. And I'm just going to let that sit throughout my shower. Now I'm going to be exfoliating with this Tree Hut exfoliating scrub. It's really important to exfoliate before you shave. I'm exfoliating, loosen up the hair follicles, get rid of all the excess dirt and buildup on my skin. And now I'm just using my Venus 5 blade razor. And I'm using my EOS shaving cream. And now I'm just rinsing out the hair mask. put some conditioner through my hair. I'm using this Garnier Fruity Sleek and Shine one and now I'm just using a shower brush. It's like a tangle teaser if you guys know what that is. It's just the off-brand one. It's really important to always use a brush that's meant for wet hair or use a wide tooth comb while you're in the shower. You could also use it after but I like to do it while I'm in the shower. And now I'm just washing my body with my Nivea body wash and my loofah. I'm also using this Tree Hut Hair Minimizing Butter on the parts of my body that are shaved because it actually really works, you'd be surprised. And now I'm going back into the sink area and I'm going to be cleaning my ears with a Q-tip. 
and then I'm gonna be using some floss sticks and now I'm just using my Crest 3D whitening strips. I'm gonna leave these in for three minutes because these ones are meant to be left in for that long. And while those are in, I'm gonna be washing my face again, just because I had shaved my face and I like to wash it again afterwards, but I'm just using my regular Dermalogica Clear Start Foaming Cleanser, and I'm gonna be using my Vanity Planet Spin for Perfect Skin Face Brush. Once I'm done with that, I'm going to be using my Bior nose strips. These ones are the witch hazel ones. Most people use the charcoal ones, but I wanted to try this one because I love witch hazel. And while I put that on, I'm just using this Apto face mask. It looks like mustard and it's kind of disgusting looking, but it works really well. <laughs> scrub this one is actually just by the brand chapstick and it's just like a mint one i really liked it and now i'm going to be using a steamer on my face there are space steamers that you can get on amazon you can get them in a lot of different places but i actually have a cold steamer that i don't really use that often so i rinsed it out and i used it on my face now i'm doing my favorite part i'm using a shade roller these are really for your skin it gets rid of redness and it makes your face look less puffy it also just feels so nice it reminded me of like being at a spa which is kind of the vibe i was going for and now i'm just going to be using my bioderma micellar water again just to make my face feel fully clean going to be using this rose hip oil drops on my face and I'm putting my survey lotion on my face and now I'm using my derma a scar gel all my acne scars but now I'm putting on this under eye cream. I'm putting on my eczema cream for the parts of my eyes that get the eczema. Here I am just taking off my whitening strips, which my face just looks beautiful, I know. Now I'm putting on a lip mask. This is the Laneige one. I love these lip sleeping masks. They're amazing. And I'm finishing off with some facial spray. This is the Rose Water Spray by Grace and Stella. And now I'm taking my hair out of my turvy twist. And I'm just putting some product in. I think this is a, the Wee Leave-In Conditioner Spray. And I'm just spraying it all throughout my hair. And then putting in my Shea Moisture Curl Cream. And I'm just scrunching my hair up while I do this. And now I'm putting my earrings back in. Now, I, you can't really see it because the video isn't that well, but I'm clipping off some of my hangnails that I have because I get a lot of them, especially during the winter. And then I'm just using some cuticle oil. It's by Essie. <laughs> Fuser on, I just poured some water in and then put some drops of my lavender essential oil in it and turned it on. And now I'm putting on a foot mask, and I love foot masks. My feet tend to get really dry, so I just put this foot, these foot masks on. These ones I've never used before, they're like a sock type of thing, and it's really cool. 
I had this on, I just chilled, drinking my tea, just relaxing. I really hope that you guys enjoyed watching this video. Please give it a big thumbs up, comment down below, hit that subscribe button, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye, guys.